just a week away until Hamilton's Around the Bay Road race takes place. More than 8,500 runners will hit up the course this year, and for the first time, it will start and finish at Tim Hortons Field. The new route means it is a longer race this year. Sean Cowan has more. Ryan and Matt are getting in a practice run on North Shore Boulevard in Burlington today before the big race next Sunday, which also takes runners along this route. Yeah, we're looking forward to it. Just the last long run before next week. So yeah, yeah should be a good one. I guess the mental effort, getting, getting the body used to running longer distances. The race has traditionally started and ended at First Ontario Centre in downtown Hamilton. But because of renovations this year, the race will have a new home, Tim Hortons Field in the East End. It's our first year at Tim Hortons Field, so we're, um, you know, a little uh, nervous, but at the same time extremely excited. This is a brand new opportunity to add some fresh um, life into the race. It's 130th anniversary, so um, this is certainly a special year, and entering uh, Tim Hortons Field we hope will be a special experience. Because of the new route, the course is actually four kilometers longer this year. Instead of the traditional 30K, it's now 34 kilometers. It's very tough. Now, the Around the Bay has never been an easy uh, race and never an easy course, uh, so we're just adding a little bit more spice to it. While runners from all over the world will be taking part next Sunday, Hamilton will benefit. St. Joseph's Healthcare Foundation has been a charity partner since 2005. In that time, St. Joe's has raised millions to support patient care and research at the hospital. Over the past 20 years, uh, 5.1 million has been raised to support things like robotic surgery, bringing a CT suite to the emergency room. Um, and this year, uh, all funds raised will go towards renewing our emergency room at the Charlton campus. For all the race details, including the road closures next Sunday, you can visit bayrace.com. And registration is now closed because the race is full. But there's still lots of opportunity to come out next Sunday and cheer on all the runners. Sean Cowan, CHCH News, Hamilton.